Joe Vasquez. This year, by the way, marks the 75th anniversary of the founding of the Civil Air Patrol. Founded in the week prior to America's entry into the war, the Civil Air Patrol mobilized the nation's civilian aviators into a valuable all-volunteer arm of the nation's home defense. Beginning in March of 1942, they conducted anti-submarine coastal patrols along the East and Gulf Coast, serving alongside the Army, Navy, and Coast Guard to force German subs to withdraw from American waters. The CAPS Courier Service ferried critical parts, equipment, and personnel between defensive industries, building the vast arsenal for democracy. And a, a diverse group of Americans, the CAP had the nation's first fully integrated aviation units and the first female aviators in uniform. Over 200,000 American men and women served in the CAP during World War II and 66 volunteer members are known to have died in the service of our nation. In 2014, the World War II members of the Civil Air Patrol received the Congressional Gold Medal. And this year, the organization celebrates 75 years of continuous service to the United States of America, proudly serving today as a civilian auxiliary of the United States Air Force, as well as a member of the Air Force's total force. Ladies and gentlemen, let's have a round of applause for the Civil Air Patrol as they commemorate 75 years.